so if you were going to give, because we're running out of time, so I want to do this for an hour. So if you're going to give a piece of advice to a mom who's in the same position you were, and you could just give her a couple of bits of advice, what would you say? What worked for me anyway was literally either photocopy one of your activities or look on Liz's blogs and get that concrete idea of, you know, if you're wanting to sit down and do an actual activity and you've done lots of free play and, you know, just played around like that and you're like, okay, I kind of want to do something a little bit more formal. I would say just copy what somebody else has done. (laughs) Because it just takes the pressure off you, you know, and to just have that little bit of an idea of, okay, well, I know where this one's going. Just, you know, it's just wetting your toe. Because for me, once I'd done that over and over from your blog post and from Lacey, and and doing the classes with you and seeing the activities from the conference, just having that framework to work within, you you gain your own confidence in, oh, okay, I, I can notice some things and oh my my child's responding and this is working and yeah, so it just for your own confidence as a crutch copy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make it hard on yourself when when other people have done it. That that's that would be my biggest biggest piece of advice because it gets you started. 